Everybody doing brother Chad. I'm gonna try this for the third time here. <laughs> Technical difficulties on my DV. Anyways, I made some videos six months a year ago. I was talking about again more trying to remove scales from my listeners' eyes. The smoke and mirrors of everything in the world right now. The deception, deception. Uh, supposed hackers in their basement stealing money out of banks. When what I see is the people in control are the ones stealing that money. Uh. I don't know where it was in the world yesterday, but one another country had all their banks fail and everybody's money was mysteriously vanished out of their bank accounts. So we're getting close to things happening and I'm sure it'll come here soon. We might be at the door of these things starting to happen. I just wanted to show you this little video here of the kind of lies these people are. They, they are like their father, the devil. They are liars. They are deceivers. And I'm just going to show you this and then talk again after. The Senate Armed Services Committee that the United States is nowhere near prepared for the dangerous multi-threat environment it's facing. The public has no idea how great threats are. Commission Chairman Representative Jane Harmon and Vice Chair Ambassador Eric Edelman issued a dire warning to the committee Tuesday. The homeland, if there's a conflict, is not going to be a sanctuary anymore, and the first uh, attacks will likely be in the cyber, cyber domain, and they will be incredibly uh, disabling. The public is essentially clueless about the massive cyber attacks that could be launched any day by our adversaries, not just nation states, but rogue actors as well. The report warns a cyber war with China or Russia would be... So she was right about one thing. The majority of the public is clueless. You're listening to liars right here. They're telling you a big cyber attack could happen within days. How, like, really, they must know uh, what that person's going to do. It's... The plans of the devil, they're all in on it. Everybody at the top has sold their soul. It's its disgusting. We need to open our eyes, remove all scales from our eyes. There is no trust in these people. All our trust is towards Jesus. Jesus, I put all my trust in you. That is where we need to be right now. These people put this stuff out here. They're sitting there in their $1,000 suits, not fearing what's about to happen because they're in the know. They're with the plans, they're part of the plans, and they're trying to brainwash you like, hey, we're the good guys, but we're not going to be to control this. This is going to happen maybe in days. Like, it's so obvious, guys. It's so obvious what these people are about. Anyways, I just wanted to put that out there really quick. Um, pray for discernment to see, eyes to see what is going on in truth, because it is very important. We're in dark days. It's the last moments Everything is deceit and, and lies right now. So stay strong, brothers and sisters. Love you guys. God bless.